What's going on YouTube? So today we have a Skog knife and I'm super excited to tell you all about it. So I recently have picked up this Skog knife and uh, I was really excited about it so I thought I would show you guys what this uh, knife's all about. Now this is a uh, just an everyday carry but what I love about this knife, I love the way it looks. It has a skeletal frame and uh, for me, uh, I just like the way it looks, so I thought I would just pick it up and uh, see if it was worth having or not. So we're going to take a look at the packaging out here. Y'all know how I do it. I like to see the details. So this is a folding knife, and they call it a cash card. Lightweight design that fits in a wallet. Includes a money clip. Has a lifetime warranty. And this is uh, part of their everyday carry knife. So, and look at that. I just love the way it looks. That was one of the uh, main reasons why I picked this knife up. Honestly, just because of the way it looks. So, so well, if it's garbage, I'll get rid of it. But this has the uh, Skog blade, which is uh, pretty good for everyday carry. It has a lock right there where you can lock and unlock it. And slim and lightweight design. And we also have a money clip here, which I use as a belt clip or a pocket. I keep it in my pocket. We have a folding blade. Blade's 2.75 inches long, and it weighs only two ounces. Unbelievable. Very lightweight. 6.2 inches overall when it's opened. And we have the uh, blade steel here. You can look up the steel there. But we have the uh, RC, the Rockwell hardness of 54 to 58, which is between uh, French and German knives. So it's going to be uh, pretty good for everyday carry. It's going to be hard, but not so brittle to where it'll uh, snap on you or break off. It says it's field tested. I'm not sure what that's all about. It offers a good sharpen blade and a lightweight skeleton frame, which I, I really like. So I own a lot of knives and I've this is my first skeletal frame knife that I can use every day. So I thought uh, I would pick this thing up and check it out. Let's get this thing open. I could tell you right off the bat, guys, this is super, super light. This is what I love about it. It's so light. So, two ounces. What weighs two ounces? A uh, large egg weighs two ounces. Two AA batteries weighs two ounces. A couple empty soda cans weighs a few ounces. So, that'll kind of give you a reference on how light this thing is. Super light. I love the way it looks. Look at that super nice i really do like that i like that shredded there you know that's always comes in handy now let's see there's your your money clip and like i said i slipped that in my jeans or my work pants and uh, i locked that on my uh, pocket there now you could take that off and just keep this in your wallet you know that would be a nice little handy thing if you don't want to carry it on your in your jeans or your pants or your coat you could always just slip it right in your wallet that's a it's actually pretty doable. Oh, and it pops out pretty easy too. I like that. That's your lock there. And it closes. Let's see how it closes. Super smooth. No issues. No jerking. It's not hard to press at all. You could easily just unlock and you can close it real easy. I like that. It's so smooth. So you could actually open this knife with one hand with a little bit of practice. You know, it doesn't have the little tab on there for you to do that. And if you just cracked it open a little bit with one hand, if you're working or something, you can pop it out and it would lock into place. You know, just like that. And I love the aesthetics of this. This is the reason why I wanted that. You know, it, I thought it would look really good. I did not realize it was so light. And look at this, got three little finger placements. So I'm not sure you would really need that, but and there's only three there, but I guess if you're in a situation where you, eh, you know, you had it, you can, you know, just uh, hold it and, you know, swipe or cut or do whatever you're going to do with it. You know, it gives you a little something to hold on instead of the plastic handles that are nice and smooth and you go to do something and you have to squeeze really hard to hold the knife. This will give you something to grip onto, which is, which is really nice. And I like that. And this, uh, that little lock, you're just your standard lock there. But it's so smooth. I, I do like it. It's, you know, really good quality for what it is. It's fairly inexpensive. What I can't get over is how light it is. And let's try to open this up. 
yeah, you can do it. It's not ideal, but you can. Like if you're working, you got something in your hand, you reach for your knife, you could do it. You know, with a little bit of practice, you just get your thumbnail in that slot there, and you just pry it up, and then use your thumb to pull it around. Definitely doable. All right, well, I am going to shave some hair, and let's see if it'll cut some hair off my arm. Now, I always do this with my knives, and this just lets me know what type of quality the blade is and how sharp it is. You know, some knives won't won't really do this well. Some knives will leave like little stubbles and stuff like that. So let's see what we got. All right, not bad. No burning, no nothing, no scraping, no pulling. And it's shaved or clean. Very nice. I don't see no blood, no, no burning, no red, nothing. I just swiped it right off. I call that pretty good right there. Let's get this wiped off here. Yeah, I do like the aesthetics of this. I think it's nice. You know, it's not like your all the other common knives that you see. You know, it just looks completely different. And it's scog, and it's it's gonna uh, the blade's gonna hold up. It's an everyday carry, so you know you can use it and actually cut stuff, and then just start sharpening. You ain't gotta worry about it. I do like the the finger holds there. Like I said, you could take that clip off if you want to store it in your pocket or in your wallet. But what I do is uh. I bend it out just slightly and I just hook it to the my work pants or my jeans or whatever I'm holding and it does fit really good so if you guys are uh, interested in a, a unique knife that's a little bit different that's not too expensive you know I'm gonna leave a link below I think this would be a great gift for any of the any of the guys out there or you know even if you have a lady friend that would like a small knife that that's different looking you know, look at it, it folds up super good so very easy very easy so i really do appreciate y'all this is going to be a quick video and i hope you uh pick this knife up and uh if you do pick it up let me know your thoughts and comments on it until next time we'll see you later